Hi, my name is Pradyum Ramkumar and I'm here to talk to you about an exciting new technology now available on MSP430, Haptics. What is Haptics? One of the biggest challenges with capacitive touch is it lacks feedback and lack of feedback causes errors. Haptics provides mechanical feedback through the use of vibration, also known as tactile feedback. TI has partnered with Immersion the leading innovator in haptics technology to offer you this product. Using haptics, you can not only reduce errors, but also increase user satisfaction and create highly differentiated products. MSP430 TCH5E enables haptics for everyone. Combining the ultra low power MSP430 capacitive touch with industry leading immersion touch sense technology, we can offer 122 unique haptic effects for different alerts and gestures. Furthermore, you can create your own haptics effects by chaining and adding delays to the different haptics. You can also play haptics to audio using audio to haptics technology. All this available as a fully programmable solution, royalty free and no complex contracts. MSP430 TCH5E can drive haptics not only from capacitive touch buttons but also from touchscreen controllers and application processors using I2C. Our solution also supports a wide range of actuators including ERM which are motor based actuators and LRA which are spring based actuators. You can evaluate haptics while having fun with our Haptouch Gaming Booster Pack. This booster pack combines capacitive touch and haptics and works with the launch pad. You can also customize haptics effects using the Haptouch GUI and create your own effects too. When you're ready to create your own product, we provide a complete reference design, the Haptouch SDK with source code and libraries and all the hardware collateral that you would need. Also, using the Touch Pro GUI, you can tune your capacitive touch buttons easily. For more information, go to www.ti.com 430 haptics. Also, there are several videos on this product and I hope you can enjoy it too. Thank you very much.